Alright, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another review by Project Science Psycho again with you today. And in this part, I am going to be reviewing Batman The Telltale Series Episode 4. So, Episode 4 is titled The Guardian of Gotham. It is the episode in which um, Batman, aka Bruce Wayne, is sent to Arkham Asylum and is hospitalized in there. The in, throughout the game, you get three major decisions. Oh, um, you get offered a call in the in the asylum. Um, so if you use the opportunity to make the phone call, you can either call Gordon and his or his lawyers while Zaz kills one of the orderlies, or if you try to stop the fight and do not take the phone call, um, you will be attacked and nearly killed by Zaz, only to be later on saved by the orderlies. Um, after that, throughout the storyline, you get a um, another choice, which prompts you to um, to go to um, to go as Bruce Wayne or Batman. I'm not gonna tell you where to go because that would be too much of a um, that would be too much spoiling throughout the game. So you can either decide to go as Bruce Wayne and Mayor Dent orders Bruce to be executed and makes it look like a suicide only to be later on rescued by Gordon or take the other op the other um, the other option and go as Batman while Mayor Dent orders Gordon to be executed and rescued by Batman so it's pretty much the same kind of cause it's either Gordon saves you as Bruce Wayne or you save Gordon as Batman so, and in the in the last decision that you you can make, um, Batman, you as Batman are given the choice of going to Wayne Enterprises to stop Penguin or to Wayne Manor to stop two things. So, I'm not gonna tell you what happens to go either way. That's for you to find out um, throughout the storyline to to play for you to go actually play the game because it is really awesome. Um, so as far as the graphics and everything go, the graphics and gameplay remain the same. It's still the, the awesome comic style that was introduced in the first um, Telltale games. Um, and the gameplay was still kept. It's still a point and click game with some um, some actions to be done in the, mi in the middle, well, amid the story. To, to kind of make it more more interesting and more kind of playable and not to just have it like a a movie. So yeah, that is gonna probably gonna be all from my side for this episode. Don't forget to like and subscribe, comment on the videos, and I'll be joining you guys in the next one.